All right, what I did here, now I went straight. I did a line. I also did a line here. Now, as I start to break this, this is going to come apart. Uh, again, if you missed it, what I'm doing here is I want to put this threshold down because I'm putting tiles in. So I want them to come flush together. So I want to put the, stick the fresh threshold down. Also, I didn't want to cut the door either. So it could be either, you know, if you want to cut the door, if you want to put the threshold down, be made different reasons why you could do this. That's just another reason. So let me go ahead now. Finish this up. And as you see, as you start to cut this, this comes apart. See? The biggest pain in the ass is getting that line across. And everything else here is easy. Just crack like this. I'm going to clean everything up here, dig it up, and I'm going to cut the threshold. Right. Now we're going to cut the threshold. This is a little wet saw I got from Home Depot. Uh, it's 50 bucks or something like that. I'm just, uh, I measured the threshold length, and I'm just going to cut it where I made the mark. That's all there is to it. So it'll be good if you wear ear protection and eye protection. And you just move this back and forth where you want it. You tighten this down. Turn this on. And you also put water, there's a tray here where you put water in. So I'm just going to cut it. Now that I cut the threshold, we're gonna cut. We're gonna cut this just to make it fit a little bit. The molding over here is in the way, so I marked it a little bit with my chisel. And I just gotta cut away over here a little saw. You can also use a saw like this. If you're doing actual wood floors, it goes flat on the floor and you just go back and forth. But for this one here, I could just use a saw like this. A little bit of the floor. Just going in with this. So that's good. Let's try this again. It's pretty good. I just I'm 
might trim this a little bit. I'll make a line here and I cut it. I'll cut it with a saw and hammer that out again. So for now, this is good. Now you mix tin set. You put it in the threshold and you install it. It should be flush with the tiles. And I'll show you how it looks like when it's all dried up. <laughs> and this is what it looks like when it's all grouted up and ready. Thanks for watching this clown's house. If you like videos like these, check out my channel and subscribe to my channel underneath. It's free to subscribe. You know you want to. And thanks for watching. Toodles.